Mheshimiwa Uhuru Kinyata jana alisema anataka kuacha inchi baada ya mezi tisa to a united peaceful nation very very good legacy that is one of the best legacies a leader can live but i want to share my thoughts with president uhuru kinyata that you cannot say you want to leave a united country when you oversaw the destruction of the only biggest national party called Jubilee. Jubilee was a national party with 175 MPs, with senators and governors. Jubilee won in all the in 44 counties of the 47 counties. And today, Mr. President, you allow crooks and con men who live around you to destroy that national party. And now again, very, very serious. Now, Mr. President, you are again busy funding and establishing regional and ethnic parties. So, Mr. President, choose between the path of uniting the country through a national party. And please support us in UDA, that is a national party. And stop allowing the mushrooming of regional ethnic parties that will destroy our country. Mr. President, today you are telling us the 8 million Jubilee supporters in your own reading are full of con men and crooks and thieves. That is an insult to the Jubilee family and to your supporters. If there is anybody, anybody, kama kuna muti mwizi Kenya, ambaye anataka kuwa kiongozi, Mr. President, you have the instruments of power. The National Intelligence Service falls under you. You have the EACC, you have the DCI, you have other, you have the Auditor General. Use those and tell the country. Don't be general, be specific. You know, be specific, you're a leader. A leader must, be, must talk with specificity. Munisikia ndugu yetu musali ya mudavadi, jana usiku. Anasema wanapigiwa simu usiku. Hawa lali. Hawa onani na mibibizao na watoto wao. Yeye na kina kalonzo na kina gideon. Hawa kuli chakula. Hawa pati usingizi. They are blackmailed and intimidated. They are being told you must support one candidate. We are telling Musali ya mudavadi. Vile wa kristo wanasema roho ya mtakatifu mekungia ndani ili kufanya uonge jana. Na tunataka kalonzo msioka pia asimame kidete. Aonge na aseme hata mimi na lazimishwa. And Mr. President, if you want Kenya to be very peaceful, every time when there is an election, there is a post-election violence, ethnic violence. The father and the mother of that violence, the common denominator is none other than your elder brother. Call your elder brother tomorrow to State House. Have a cup of tea with him. Invite the media. Let him publicly, in your presence, declare that when, inshallah, when William Ruto beats him in 2022, he will accept defeat. Manana ndio hiyo, sinio? Jana, Raisa mesema kitu ya mana sana. Tumemusikiza kwa makini na tumefry. Hamesema yeye ataki watu ya Kenya wachagwe mwizi na mkora. 
na amefanya mzuri kwa sababu hatuwezi chagua mwizi kwa sababu mwizi ako kamiti amefungwa na kama rais ako na habari kuna mtu mwizi anataka kusimama afanye mpango ashikwe apelekwe kotini afungwe hata kuwa kwa kinyang'anyiro si iko namna hiyo namba 2 rais amesema pia anataka Kenya ikuwe na amani na hataki fujo na rais huyu wetu wako na bahati sana sasa hiyo maneno hata si yetu ni yake sasa mwenye kuleta fujo Kenya ni rafiki yake na dugu yake kwa sababu ndio akishindwa anakataa matoke sasa kazi ya rais ni, ni, ni kidogo sana ni akae na huyu dugu yake wakunywe uji akule samaki amuulize wewe ukishidwa utakubali ama utatoa fujo ukishidwa utaenda kujiapisha si huyu kitandawidi akikubali maneno imeisha na kwa sababu hii kitandawidi hapana mtu straight rais amwambie aandike pahali kama jana rais ametuambia anataka kuacha nchi kama imeshikana watu wameungana ili ile msingi mzee kibaki aliacha nchi imeshikana iendelee na na hiyo na uchumi amesema isirudi nyuma mahali kibaki aliachia na yeye mahali ataachia shida ni moja tu kwa uchumi ameturudisha nyuma mara kumi mahali kibaki alituachia kwa hivyo hapo kwa uchumi hatutaongea sana uchumi tutaunda na bottom up irudi mahali kibaki aliachia tukienda juu au sio sababu yake imekuwa trickle down imetutoa mahali kibaki alituachia ikarudi chini pia akatuambia watu wawe wameshikana waungane kusiwe na vita na mimi nakubaliana na rais uhuru kenyata kabisa na sisi kama mahasla hiyo ndiyo tunataka nchi imeungana yenye haina vita mtu akishinda uchaguzi yeye mwenye ameshindwa akubali ameshindwa asituletee vita akiitisha handshake kingine sio tumekubaliana na ndio anaona sisi kama hasla nation tumeungana bila kuangalia mtu ni dini gani ni kabila gani tukashikana wote kama mahasla tuunde serikali na akatuambia pia kuna watu wanaambia sijui kama ni mimi aliona ninakimbia sana lakini nitamuomba kwa heshima atukubalie tukimbie tuunde serikali ingine sababu yenye tuliunda 2017 ilienda na wengine au sio la mwisho akatuambia tujihadhari tusichague wakora na wezi na majambazi na hiyo mimi nakubaliana na yeye kabisa au sio sababu wakora Kenya hii ni wengi iko wale wakora walipora mali ya umma kwa wizara ya afya na unajua ingekuwa mzuri kama rais angetusaidia atuambie hawa wakora ni akina nani tusiwachague au sio tunajua pia hii reli ya SGR imejengwa ilikuwa na wizi ya zaidi ya bilioni moja na ishirini pia tunataka tujue wenye walipora hiyo pesa ya SGR ni akina nani ili ikifika kwa uchaguzi tusiwachague si ndio iko wengi kwa makaunti governments wamepora mali ya umma tuwajue pia kwa maji kwa majina juzi tumepata janga la corona pesa hapa ko, kemsa covid billionaires rais mwenyewe kwa mdomo yake akatuambia bila kupita siku ishirini na moja wale wakora wamepora pesa ya covid kemsa billionaires wale kotini wameshtakiwa mwaka umeisha na miezi mbili hawajashikwa pia rais atujulishe hawa wakora wale walikuwa akina nani hawashikwi si ndio mimi nilichakuliwa kwa chama cha jubili sasa mimi niko kwa chama cha UDA. Na mkubwa yangu aliye rais kwa heshima kubwa nimeona ni kama anaanza kuongea in parables. Kwa sababu mimi nikiwa mjumbe kama jambo limeenda mbaya kule constituency yangu nasema vile ilivyo ama namna gani? Kama kuna mwizi nasema mwizi fulani fulani ni mwizi. Lakini sasa kidogo eh 
mkubwa yangu kwa heshima kwa sababu ni rafiki yangu na ni mkubwa na nimeheshimu sana ameanza kidogo kuongea kwa inparables na hii haitusaidii kwa sababu tuko na covid billionaires tunajaribu kutafuta ni wakina nani waliiba pesa ya covid na hatujaambiwa majina na jana alikuwa anasema ati kuna wezi sijui pengine ni wale waliiba covid ama namna gani alafu kuna wale wale pia walichukua equipment medical equipment zile medical equipment zilikuwa hapa zikapelekwa kwa counties nyingi bado hatujasikia mpaka leo hii ni wakina nani walileta medical equipment wakapelekwa kwa county zote Kenya hii leo hii pesa inachukuliwa direct kule treasury kwa hivyo nataka nimuombe kwa heshima kubwa kwamba rais wetu yuko na mwaka mmoja na lazima aweze kutuambia ule anaiba ni nani na wale wanatakana wakose kusimama ni wakina nani kuliko kuongea in parables tuko pamoja wa mazai asante speaking as the deputy president of the republic of kenya i want to tell the people of kenya that we will have a peaceful nation there will be no violence there will be no acrimony hakutakuwa na msukosuko hakutakuwa na fujo kama wa kenya tulikubaliana ya kwamba hakuna tena wakati tutagawanywa na kupiganishwa na siasa it will never happen again we made a pledge to ourselves and before god that kenya shall be peaceful and kenya shall be united na sisi wote ambao eh, ni viongozi hatutaki ukorofi ama fujo tunataka kufanya mambo yetu kwa amani kila mtu hakuna mtu ma, eh, mwenye amet, malaika ametoka mbinguni jana sisi wote ni wa Kenya tuko hapa si ndio wale wote wanatafuta kiti ya rais wanajulikana na sio wageni kwa Kenya si namna hiyo so kila mmoja wetu akuje na mambo tatu ndio ikuwe rais number one, jipange na agenda na plan kama hii yetu ya bottom up nyinyi kujeni na yenu number two, kuja na track record hakuna mtu ameshuka jana siki si mwingine alikuwa prime minister mwingine akakuwa makamu wa rais mwingine akakuwa deputy prime minister si mimi nitakuja hapa niseme nilipanga hii barabara ya Imaroro mpaka Mashuru si nitasema nilipanga ile ya Ngong kwenda mpaka Suswa si nimeongeza stima kutoka hapa 30000 mpaka 145000 si wale wengine pia wakuja waseme ile yao wamefanya hao wananchi wataamua e, kwani ngo shida hapo si kila mtu akuja na track record yake ama namna gani yes mimi na waulizeni tusikubali kwenda reverse kwa vyama ya kona hii kabila ile sehemu ile tunataka tuungane sote kwa hii chama ya UDA vile tuliungana kwa chama ya Jubilee kwa sababu Jubilee ilipata ajali si mnajua tulipata ajali kidogo tulitembelewa na marafiki wengine hapo sijui walikuja na mapepo ile Jubilee ikaanza kuwa chama ya Kisirani nafuguza huyu leo nafuguza huyo kesho nafuguza ule siku nyingine mwisho wale wako nje wamekuwa wengi kuliko wale wako ndani mnanielewa mimi nataka tu kuambia wanasiasa sisi wote wakati unapokuja madhabahu ukiona pale ambapo bishop anakaa mabishop ukialikwa kwa kanisa ingia polepole pole. Uonyeshwe pali ya kukalia. Usije kwenda kukalia kiti ya bishop. Majusi Baba. U, baba Raila Amolo Odinga alisukumwa na maombi ya Ruto na kanisa. Alipoenda kanisa aliona kanisa wameamuka eh, kumwalika. Badala ngoja aonyeshwe kiti ameenda street kwa sababu ajiwage kanisa mpaka amekalia kiti ya bisho. <laughs> Ninaomba tu wanasiasa ukiingia 
Uulise kanisa ni wapi ambayo unafaa. Una, unaenda polepole. Unakuja polepole. Unaonyeshwa njia pale ya kukaa. Ninaomba sisi sote tushikane tuunge mkono Hasla Nation. Sisi ni watu wa jubilee kwa miaka kumi kwa uhuru mwegai Kenyatta na tunaheshimu na anaendelea kumalisa kasi yake vizuri na kwa sababu dunia imehama kwa William Ruto ninaomba tu watu wote watu wa Mungu kwa sababu Mwenyezi Mungu amesema hapa tunaelewana tunaelewana tuhame sisi wote kwa UDA Jana tumesikia Musalia Mudabadi amesema hatuwezi lazimishwa kwenda kuchagua wale watu ambao sisi hatuwezi kuchagua. Sisi kama wakaaji wa Kajado East ama wakajado wakaaji wa Kajado County tumeamua ni William Samoei Ruto. Hatutalazimishwa na mtu, hatutasurutishwa, tumeamua mbele ya Mungu na mbele ya wananchi. Wale wote wanataka kusimama katika chama chetu cha UDA. Tufanye registration Tufanye registration ya chama Ili hawa wanainchi wote waingie kwenye chama Ili ile siku ya nomination Uyu atapata wakumchagua kwa nomination Mimi nitapata wakumchagua kwa nomination Na hata mweshimua na ibu wa rais Atapata milioni tatu ya wanachama Wakueza kusimamia nomination yake Ile wakati tutaitaji Anamshukuru Mungu. Bwana Yesu asifiwe sana. Eh, yo que aquí quiero que nada, mamá, yo la quiero ni no, no. Uy, mamá, no, mamá, no, 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 no